Good morning peoples. Well this is my usual um, start to a video is it? Uh, I've come down to Brisbane and um, picked up the old girl and I'm going to take her for a ride up to uh, up the coast and visit family. Um, yeah, give her a run because he uh, basically lives in Brisbane due to the uh, driveway at the property. Uh, yeah, so this is Brisbane traffic, don't you? Just love it. After living in the bush for a while, I'll tell ya, you don't miss this shit. Yeah, boy, it's been a while since I jumped on the sporty and, uh, man, it's like getting out of a four-wheel drive into a sports car. You feel like your ass is dragging along the ground. It's so low. But, uh, yeah, it's kind of good, but it's nice to be able to plant your feet firmly on the ground for a change. Here we are coming into the, um, the airport link tunnel. Yep, slow down, it's only 60. Don't want to get booked in Brisbane. Crazy place, crazy place. Getting crazier by the day. And here we are. Entering the tunnels. There's a bird flying through there. <laughs> Can't speed in these things, you got cameras all the time, so. You had a bit of an uphill so we can make a better racket. I love it. It's surreal in these tunnels, eh? Something out of a futuristic movie. Just cruise along the um, Yandina Coolum Road. That's uh, Mount Coolum over there. It's a lovely, uh, lovely road along here, but the problem is the speed limit's 80, and the police do patrol it. So we better be good and stick to the speed limit. So it used to be all cane country around here. Oh, there you go, look at that. It, you don't have to slow down to 60 car. You can do 80, that's what the speed company on, mate. What are you doing? Oh, check it out, eh? Got the awning and everything on it. Oh. <laughs> anyway, yeah, so. Obviously, as I was saying, <laughs> better stick to the speed limit along here. Bloody hell, you don't know what they're in these days. But uh, I'll give a weather report. So on the way down from Toowoomba this morning, it poured down in a couple of spots. And by the time I transferred the backpack and phone holder and that onto this bike and stuff, they are all gone, so that's all right. So we've got a few clouds hanging around, could be another shower this afternoon they reckon, whatever. Um, yeah, but apart from that, lovely, it's warming up, I think it's going to be fairly warm today. Well, good day legends, it's the next day, and um, 
we're just going to go for a bit of a, a ride up around the inland. Uh, Mullaney, probably Mapleton, maybe out to Kenilworth, <coughs> stuff like that. So there should be some good scenery for y'all. So um, come along for the ride and uh, enjoy the day. In the palm woods. these uh, Sunshine Coast tin land towns. <coughs> the weather's a little bit cooler up here on the hills as usual. Well, I think it will warm up today. I don't think I've ever been up this road. Like I say, this is Roy's bloody playground. <laughs> oh, I have no idea where really. I am. But it's a uh, pretty good road. Here we are, stuck behind some trucks on the way up to Mullaney. Rory's just single left, so I think we're going to turn off somewhere along here. No? Don't know. Oh, hang on. Now what have we got? Now what have we bloody got up here? Road works or something. like the library trucks broken down. Yay. That stuff all over the road doesn't look good. Going from stopped to not quite stopped truck. <laughs> oh, here we go, turning off here. Oh, there we go, look. Gargan, Crookneck, all the Glasshouse Mountains, look at that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I said look out for cyclists. Oh, she's cool up here. Like I did put me flat on. Look at that, eh? That's pretty awesome. I hope the camera's picking it up.
this is the uh, way up to Maloney from the Laneyborough Road, which is um, usually over the last 350 years that I've been alive, we've uh, always come up from the south side, not from the well, there, well, yeah, the southern way, or as opposed to the northern direction. Yeah, it wasn't until we got here at the turn off, I went, I know where I am. This is this Mullaney, Montville, Mapleton sort of uh, country. It's like this all the way across. It's, it's like a big ridge that runs all in behind the Sunshine Coast. She was a favourite haunt when we were uh, a lot younger. Anyone who uh, grew up riding bikes around Brisbane would know all these roads very well. The uh, Mapleton pub was a, a favourite haunt for lunch. We'll probably head down to the Mullaney. We'll probably go west to Ken oh, what? Kenilworth. Well, we're coming into Mullaney. Yeah, busy little town these days. Music shop, eh? Maloney Hardware. So it looks like we will go through the main street of Maloney. Because we're going to go down the Conondale Range. But we're going to go and have a look at a at the Obi Obi Lookout. Well, I said you can't get a park here on the weekends. <laughs> can't get a park here through the week. Okay, that's what he's saying. He would have been saying, I missed the tunnel. Picnic here. Yeah. Alright. Oh. Obi Obi lookout. There we go. Cool, all right, we'll get some fucking happy snaps here. So, that's the Obi Obi lookout, very nice. What are you doing there, Rory? Very nice.
This is a Conondale range. <coughs> Expect delays. Uh, good, they're doing some regen work. There goes Rory. The maniac. Conondale. It's a people free day at school. Okay. Kids would be happy about a long weekend, wouldn't they? There's always that one place right on the edge of town that's got all the junk, isn't there? <laughs> no, anyway, that my friends was Conondale. Here we are in Kenilworth. Oh, Kenilworth, the RV capital of the Sunshine Coast area, I reckon. Man, it's Friday. I don't know these people got jobs to go to. Tiger! Tiger! There's the pup, I've stayed there. This is a nice run out through here. This is the, I think it's the um, Imbul Blue Road or something. It's a nice little back road in behind the coast here. So it's just north, going north of Kenilworth instead of veering to the east to go back up either over the OBOB or whatever. Yeah. Wind's picking up. We just turned off and come to a little place called Brulu. Just wish the camera would turn on quicker, but anyway. So this was or this is Boo Boo. This is a nice little hidden back road, this one. Coming into Imbul. So if you see over there, you probably won't be able to see it on the camera. That's all part of the rail trail. I didn't know it come up this far. 
Nó khỏi Ôi dì à There's a rail line. Is that part of the rail trail as well? Or is that an actual rail line? I don't know, it must be here part of the rail trail. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay, because they've got an old train and stuff here. Yeah, yeah, okay. Right, yeah, I have been to this part. I didn't realise it was part of the rail trail, but I knew they had an old train in that day. Near the pub here. Yeah, where are you? <laughs> oh, here we are in Imble. La uh, left Imble. Just had a short break there. And we're going to head out through Kadanga and uh, so we're turning on at the Merry Valley Link Road. Just before Ammermore, wouldn't be too far out of Ammermore, I wouldn't reckon. about the Caltex. Okay. Where are we? Chukut Koi Kai Bong. Bruce Highway, Brisbane Koran, uh, yeah. or the Koran. Uh. Oh, there's the there's the old Matilda. Look, hey. <laughs> Or something down in there in that gully. Oh, yeah. 
Yep, Cramston Road, Coran. It's coming into Coran. Check out the old van, the cart. Alright. Well, that was Korean, eh? Very good. Footy field. Let's see if we got the um, we can have the last house out of town for a junk type place. Oh, that one's uh, close to it. Yeah. Not as good as some. <laughs> And that is the Kinkin Road. Busy little road. A lot of stuff going on around the place, isn't there? Oh, it's big. New bridge and everything, eh? Big time stuff. Anyway, I won't bore you, bore you, bore you with sitting here. Coming into Pomona. <laughs> Quite a way of that road works. Man, terrible.
good old Kuroi. And I like Roy. I like all the towns. <laughs> Roy Butter Factory. Everywhere used to have a butter factory, eh? I suppose because your butter couldn't um, travel as far. You know, they didn't have the refrigeration back in the early days to transport the butter, so every sort of town, especially if it was in a dairy area, would have a butter factory to make the butter for the locals, I suppose. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed the day out around the uh, back blocks behind the Sunshine Coast, Kenilworth and so forth. And if you did, give us a like, subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Uh, get through these twisties.